Hey guys, it's Jordan bringing you guys another tobacco review. This evening I have Something Girly Nouveau uh, Moon Melon, which came in this little nifty tin. This is a 50 gram pack. Sorry about the glare. I don't know where that came from, but it's like this cantaloupe color. Uh, there's the top, which um, I don't know where that glare came from. Crazy. Um, it's a girl with a moon on her head, very Sailor Moonish. Not really Sailor Moonish, it's just a chick with like a crescent on her head and a cantaloupe. Um, it smells very cantaloupey. It's quite inviting. I just got some on my lip. <laughs> um, the smell of this is very cantaloupey. Uh, if you remember from my review from Very Broken Hearted, the cut of the tobacco is the same. Um, I can't show you in this video because this is the second bowl and I've smoked it all. <laughs> um, it's a very long cut, not exactly soaked in juice, but uh, kind of on a sticky side. Uh, it was very easy to pack. I'm using a Vortex bowl, and I finally got my hands on some Coconaro, so I threw three of those on top. Uh, there's not a wind cover on right now. The standard KM single pair hookah using an Amor hose today because I think my pro hose has a kink in it. Pretty sure it does. Um, let me show you guys some of the clouds and then we'll get on to the flavor. Sorry, I'm using two, two. I'm on two laptops right now. I apologize. Oh, before I get on to the how this tastes, which is fantastic, by the way. Uh, what I did not know until just today, and I don't know why, because I've had three tens of this laying around. But um, something girly has two lines: modern and. Nouveau, if I'm pronouncing that right. I hope I am. If I'm not, someone please correct me in the comments, but I think it's pronounced Nouveau. I didn't look at a pronunciation key. But um, I'm not entirely sure of the difference between these two. I think maybe the Nouveau is supposed to be a little stronger than the Modern. Again, I could be wrong. I believe Modern was all that was around the before something really disappeared and came back. Um, I went onto the medwa.com website, which is where you can purchase something girly from, and uh, I didn't get too much of a flavor description. However, the description is interesting there. I would read it, but it sounds entirely like I'm reading a romantic novel, so you know, I'm not going to do that, but feel free to go do that before you buy some. Um, let's see if I can pinpoint what this tastes like a little bit besides the cantaloupe It's really good. I don't know if this is supposed to be cantaloupe and anything else, but it's definitely very melon flavored. Definitely very, very cantaloupey. And as you can see, I'm getting some pretty good clouds off of this as well. Um, it's very melony and I don't know how these girls do this but there's such strong flavor but at the same time it's so light I don't know how they do it but it's fantastic <laughs> I don't know what your secret is girls but you are doing everything right um, I've only had this bowl lit for about 10 minutes so I can't speak really to the buzz on this 
compared to the modern. Maybe modern's a little more stronger one. Yeah, if I think back doing that very broken hearted, I think there is a little bit more buzz to this. Or to the modern as opposed to the nouveau. I mean, either way, both lines are great, um, but I think, I could be wrong again, if somebody knows, feel free to correct me, or if I figure it out, I will correct myself in this video, somewhere down in the comments and whatnot. But I think Du is a little bit stronger, as far as the buzz factor. The flavors between the two lines are pretty similar. Um, both of them are just they're full of flavor, but somehow it's just really light. I don't, maybe the, I think it's just the smoke itself, as thick as the clouds are. I think the smoke itself is pretty light. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. I, I have no words. Other than this is fantastic, and I plan to continue to smoke something girly. Uh, just because it is labeled something girly, guys, go out and buy some, because this is really good. Um, that's pretty much it for this video. I'm going to keep it short. I'm going to finish this. I've got one more tin of something girly, the fulfillment, which I'll be doing next. Uh, I may be slightly critical because I love all things mint. So hopefully the girls are bringing something extremely minty to the mint field. Alright guys, my name's Jordan. I'm going to get out of your hair and uh, I'll catch you guys later.